Brachial artery. The brachial artery is a major artery supplying the arm and is a continuation of the axillary artery at the inferior border of the teres major muscle. It runs downwards and laterally crossing the elbow joint. It enters the cubital fossa and terminates by dividing into the radial and ulnar arteries at the level of the neck of the radius. Its relations are as follows. Anteriorly, in the upper part, it is related to the medial cutaneous nerve of the forearm. In the middle part, it is crossed from the lateral to medial side by the median nerve. And in the lower part, it is crossed by the bicipital aponeurosis. Posteriorly, from above downwards, it is related to the long head of triceps, medial head of triceps, coracobrachialis, and brachialis muscles. Medially, in the upper part, the ulnar nerve, and in the lower part, the median nerve. Laterally, in the upper part, it is in relation with the median nerve, coracobrachialis, and biceps brachii. In the lower part, the tendon of the biceps brachii. Its branches are as follows. The profunda brachii artery, superior ulnar collateral artery, inferior ulnar collateral artery, nutrient artery to the humerus, muscular branches, and the radial and ulnar arteries are its terminal branches. A point to be noted here is pulsations of this artery are felt or auscultated when taking blood pressure. Profunda brachii artery. It arises from the brachial artery posteromedially below the lower border of the teres major. It leaves the lower triangular space along with the radial nerve and passes down along the radial groove. It then divides into the deltoid or ascending branch which ascends between the long and lateral heads of the triceps and anastomoses with the descending branch of the posterior circumflex humeral artery. An anterior or descending branch, also known as the radial collateral artery, which takes part in the anastomosis around the elbow. A posterior descending branch, also known as the middle collateral artery, which also takes part in the anastomosis around the elbow, and a nutrient branch to the humerus. Superior ulnar collateral artery. This artery travels alongside the ulnar nerve posterior to the medial epicondyle and takes part in the anastomosis around the elbow. Inferior ulnar collateral artery. This artery descends anterior to the medial epicondyle and also takes part in the anastomosis around the elbow after dividing into anterior and posterior branches.